In this video, we will learn about the two types of buttons that we can insert in our form. So first one is submit button and the next is the reset button. Okay, so let us see how it is inserted. First, open the input tag and specify the type as submit. Now, I am going to insert the attribute value. Let us save the page and see the output. Now, you can see the button named submit. Whatever text written in the attribute value will display on the button. So, let us change and see. Now, refresh the page. Yes, you can see the text over the button has changed. When you click on the submit button, all the data that we have filled will be saved. Now let us see how to insert a reset button. We have to change the type from submit to reset. Also you can change the text of value. So you can see the name as reset over the button. Children have a look at this example. I have inserted two check boxes and a reset button. I am going to select some of the data and when I press the reset button, you can see all the values have reset to its initial value. Now I have inserted one more form control that is the radio buttons. Now let us see. So now we can see four controls on the form. Let us mark some of the form controls and once you click on the reset button you can see all the values have changed to its initial form. One more example 